in this SNP, we'll be adding a VMware ESXi host to our Veeam Backup and Replication inventory using PowerShell. I've already got my Veeam PowerShell session running, and I'll start by specifying the credentials that I'll be using to connect to my ESX host. We'll do this using the get credential command loop and supplying the username and password. We'll then run add VBR ESXi and provide the name. This could be either a IP address or a fully qualified name. And then I can provide the credentials. After a moment, you'll be shown the status of the running job. And then you'll provide information about the ESXi server you've just added to your backup and replication inventory. Notice that the description has been automatically generated, stating that it's been created by PowerShell. If you wanted to provide your own description when adding your server, you could simply provide it using the description parameter. And you could also specify your username and password rather than a credential object. However, do note that this password is a plain text string, so do be careful if you go that route. It's much safer to use a credential object. That's been adding a VMware ESXi host to Veeam Backup and Replication. Thank you for watching.